Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we have Aman Maheshwari here, who's recently got placed in ION through his campus placements at VIT, and he's here to share his interview experience with us. So before that, let me just first tell you the eligibility criteria. So the eligible branches were CSC, IT, ECM, and ECE. Uh, 10th grade and 12th grade, 60% or 6 CGPA above and 60% or 6 CGPA above in the pursuing degree and no standing arrears. Hi Amman, welcome to our channel. Firstly, congratulations on your placement. Uh, thank you for coming here. And first, would you like to introduce yourself? Yeah, thank you so much Jishnu for inviting. Uh, so, uh, hi guys, I am Amman and I am from PIT Chennai. I am a fourth year graduate. Uh, currently in my 8th semester and uh, my branch is computer science. Okay, so f uh, would you like to tell, I mean, your uh, in your interview process, how many rounds were there and what did they comprise of? Uh, yeah, definitely. So the rounds were pretty much similar to all the other companies uh, with just some twists over there. The first one was coding with uh, a bit of aptitude in it. So we have one question, we had to solve that and then uh, some aptitude questions were there, uh, like pretty much basic aptitude, uh, completing the series and all that kind of things. So we get the, the result of that coding round the next day. Then there was a, a technical round the next day. So in technical round, we had uh, one technical question and then there were like one technical coding question and then there were some pretty much good technical questions. So. I remember some questions that were asked to me and uh, one that I felt was difficult was uh, uh, so the situation was uh, we have a city and then we have to deliver products in that city and what what were the what the constraint was that uh, we have to maximize the profit and uh, minimize the uh, traveling cost over there and I, I I'm like I guess I'm missing some of the other constraints, but uh, they were also there. Uh, okay. So yeah, this was the question. Then uh, the solution building was really good. The interviews interviewers were really supportive. So initially, uh, I started building up the solution with different uh, brute force logics, and then finally I realized that uh, this was more of a graph question, wherein we have to use uh, the jap trees algorithm. Mm. Uh, and that was yeah pretty much acceptable over there. Okay. Then uh, the next question which I remember is of system designs. Okay. So that question was pretty much cool. Mm. Uh, I would say like uh, it was a pretty basic question wherein what we have to do is uh, we have a room and nine servants are there and whenever the doorbell rings we have to uh, pick one servant and uh, ask him to open the room. Okay. But the constraints were like uh, if a worker is busy so he cannot go and if he wants to go so it depends on the amount of work which he has done and is left so this was the technical round okay. pretty much technical okay then so how um, long was it for okay so uh, it was like uh, the technical round was one hour to one hour 15 minutes okay. if i remember correctly Okay, and uh, were there any other questions like from operating systems or DBMS or networks? Uh, so, um, I don't remember that exactly, but I'm pretty much sure networking was not there. Okay. Operating system, maybe one or two questions were there, but they were like pretty much easy. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, continuing that, mm. uh, uh, the next day results were announced. So, 37, I guess 37 students in all were selected for two different roles, Dev and CS. Okay. Then uh, there was an ION day. So what basically ION day is, we have three different rounds over there. Mm -hmm. Last one is not considered as a round itself, but uh, yeah, the first one was wherein uh, we were presented with a, a comprehension kind of thing. Then we have to go through it and then we uh, when there were questions asked, we have to present our views over there and mm. also a good supporting point that why we are saying that why we are in favor of some things okay. uh, this was the first thing then the next day next thing that happened in the ion day was uh, uh, this round was basically with the vp software vp engineering in the company mm. and then we had uh, like uh, he presented us with one picture and then uh, the picture depicted the life cycles of uh, software development in the industry okay. so there were two different scenarios and uh, 
we have to pick one and then we have to give a reason that why we have chosen one then uh, there were some good questions also one which i remember that was asked to me uh, was uh, five dynamic factors that change the train ticket price on daily basis okay so this was like pretty much good for me to think on spot mm. then uh, after an hour i guess i got uh, the selection uh, i got my name in the selection list okay and then the last round was pretty much the introduction with uh, uh, india head uh, sanjay chikara sir mm. then uh, like we gave a normal introduction over there and then we were asked uh, about our location preferences so yeah that was pretty much it that okay. ends the round and the next day early morning <laughs> we got a uh, selection results okay okay yeah so that's that's great and congratulations so thank you for uh, joining us and do you have any tips for uh, people who want to join ion yeah like thank you so much for inviting me and uh, about tips uh, uh, there are no as such unique or such kind of tips i would rather say that uh, practice coding a lot of coding is required for placements uh, for placements in really good companies and uh, some you should like go with some uh, computer science topics also right you shouldn't yeah. miss them completely mm. but a basic understanding of that would be enough yeah. mm. Okay thank you so much thank you for joining thank you everyone for watching